I've had this topic on my mind for a while now, um, but the closer I get to talking about it, the more I think I've already done it, but it never hurts to revisit if it's helpful. So today we're going to talk about the difference between foolproof and foolproof. And the difference is really quite simple. Foolproof is a term that exists. Foolproof is not. However, I still am constantly hearing people use the term foolproof as if I've come up with a foolproof plan. Well, no, you didn't. You came up with a foolproof plan because that plan is not able even to be messed up by a fool. That's what foolproof means. Um, However, I was watching another YouTuber the other day and he used the term foolproof to describe um, a tool that he was using. And I can't remember the exact way that it was used, but it actually made sense as foolproof because most of the time people use foolproof. You can substitute foolproof, the actual phrase, and it works. But this time foolproof made sense. And the only, the only way really that I can think that foolproof makes sense in any way is when you're talking about alcohol, because obviously the strength of alcohol is measured in things called proofs. So if you have a certain percentage proof that, uh, what the higher or lower that percentage is, the more alcohol content or the stronger the alcohol content in that particular drink. Um, so a full, full proof, whatever, a full proof drink would be the highest possible alcohol content. Well, obviously that doesn't apply to tools or doing any sort of woodworking, which is what the video I was watching was talking about. Um, so I'm not sure why it made sense to me, but I, I'll have to go back and find it again. And if I do, um, I might include it in the description or in a comment down below. But, uh, just, just know that foolproof means, oh, excuse me, means unable to be messed up or thwarted by a fool. Um, so an example again would be, uh, if you had a method for, I don't even know, making pancakes, this is the full proof method for making pancakes, meaning everybody can do it, even the most foolish person, and their pancakes will turn out just fine. Uh, full proof is not a phrase that exists, exists in any way, and, um, should not be used to describe something that you think is going to work no matter what. That is not what that phrase means or how it should be used. So, yeah. (laughs) I will see you this afternoon. Bye-bye.